See, to me, it looked like the arrows were only going one way. I can see the slow sign in either direction, but the arrows, weirdly, are pointing in one direction. Okay, so service road. Um, let's have a depot thing over here somewhere, I guess. Right, and then we want a... What does it count as? Fuel depot. Which has to be... Facing inwards, I guess. Fuel tanks. I'm guessing that'll do for now. Uh, it Mick Bar, it's released on Steam, but it's an um, early access game. Speaking of which, how do we even save this? Uh, save game. Eee. There we go. Yeah, it was on sale yesterday. It came out about 7 o'clock last night, I think. Right, so we've got that. Let's speed that up so that actually gets built today. B soy, how you doing? Happy anniversary. I guess we're waiting for parts. Whoa, look at that. Oh, they're building a fence. Do I have to run a perimeter fence around this? Wowzers, look at that. What the heck? Firefighter, 33 months, glad to be here. 33 months of quality, top notch entertainment. Also, got to go my first FIA World Endurance Championship race in Austin, Texas two weeks ago. Had a blast. Yay! Nice one. Thank you, Firefighter. Yagis! <coughs> 48 months, Jagis, and no message. What are you doing, bro? Four years support. Four years and no message. Thank you for four years. That is amazing. The fence is not required. Currently not required. Okay, decoration. Got you. Right. So is that operational? We don't need to do anything else there now. So now what? I can procure something? Procurement. I need an aircraft stand. Oh my god. Well, we can get the contract, can't we? Zip fuel. Contract signed. So presumably they'll just turn up with fuel and deliver it now. Four years. Hurrah for me and you, sir. Welcome epic, dude. Epic. House. I wish you had a new uh, a new acorn, but not yet. JG Gaming 16. <coughs> Thank you for subbing. Can we give JG... GJ? JG? JJ? How can you say that? JG. A nutty welcome, guys. That's going to be really confusing for me, uh, JG, because we've also got GJCP, and that took me a while to get my head around, and now I've got JG Gaming, which is going to blow my mind. Uh, Firefighter, yeah, the other one was Sim Airport. Here we go, look at this. It's got 400,000 litres. Main tank can take 200,000. Supplementary tank can take 40,000. So he can fill the whole lot. Easy. Uh, Zinam, yes, that's why the camera was messed up today, because I was messing about with a second camera, trying to get it working. That's why all the... Because uh, Logitech drivers are amongst the worst in the industry. And I, I honestly mean that. Like, if you've got one webcam, it works mostly fine. There are things that it doesn't do, but it mostly works fine. If you put two Logitech cameras on the same PC, the drivers go, whoa, what's this? We never coded for this. <laughs> and then all hell breaks loose, and you end up changing the settings on one cam, and it actually affects the other camera, which is why all the color was out. Because I had a second camera in there. It's an absolute nightmare. Right, we've got that. We need to... Uh, let's see. First thing you need to do is procure fuel technology about the procurement panel. We've kind of done that. It says completed. So it completely lied.
You've heard you have to have the other camera on a separate USB controller. Yeah, I guess you could do that by putting one on USB and one on USB 3. Maybe. I don't know. Well, maybe maybe Shazen, but that's more money, isn't it, to buy another camera? Referic, 21 months, not house. Referic, radio check. Confirmed sub clearance. Quark, 21 months. Frequency, 499. Thank you, Squirrel. Roger Wilco out. <laughs> nice one, Referic. Tasmanian Devils, bro, 21 months. The months keep adding up. Ninja, whoop whoop, 16. Right, um, let's see. So where does the manual leave us now then? That was construction course, wasn't it? So if we go back, we've done that. Aircraft and airlines, looking to gain some knowledge. Right, aircraft stands, this sounds good. Aircraft are a core element of your airport's operations. Aircraft require an aircraft stand to be able to park at your airport, and there are several stand sizes it can be built. Small aircraft stand can be operated by both GA uh, and smaller commercial. If you want to enable commercial flights on a stand, the stands are required to be placed adjacent to the terminal building with a secure zone and to be connected with a boarding desk. Okay. Stands that are not, not that are only intended for operation by GA can be placed anywhere and do not require direct connection with the terminal structure. Oh, yeah. Well, at the moment, we've only got fuel uh, for GA, but I'm kind of wondering if... Um, if it would be worth changing that and dropping in what was it infrastructure try to remember where everything was fuel tank drop another one of these in Wait a second. You have to choose the one you want. Spotted that at the last second. What does that arrow mean? Um, who was that? Benjamin Stubbs with a thousand bits. Hey, how are you, Paul? I'm all right, Benjamin. I'm just trying to get my head around this game. Thank you very much for the thousand bits. Thank you, sir. Score, build your ga GA gates first so you attack the runway so you at least bring in some money. Okay, it's not really telling me to do that yet, but... Small aircraft stand can be operated by GA and commercial and can be built with grass, concrete, or asphalt foundation. Um, okay. How do we do that then? Transportation, star mine, the structure, building fuel, other. Where are the gates then? Small stand, medium stand. A basic stand work. Light class aircraft can park. Available turnaround services include refueling and aircraft maintenance. All right. So if you build, if we build some stands, what down here? No, it's not final release. It's early access. Does it matter exactly where we put? Okay, what is this actually showing me? Taxiway is that way? Plane park's that way, or is this the road? Is that like a zebra crossing on a road or something? What is that? If they're for GA, it doesn't matter where you put them. Yeah, that's why I'm thinking of putting them down here, you see.
I don't know if the zebra's for the service road. That's what I'm wondering. But when I try to do that, it doesn't allow it. Would it do that? Yes, it would. Okay. So we could... The GA stuff, we could actually have it like that. The thing is, though... Happy anniversary. Where are they trying to get to? If they're crossing... If they're crossing that service road, where are they trying to get to? Does that imply we need a... Um, a, a sidewalk that way or something? Good evening, Sicario. That feels like it's too far away to me because he's putting it all the way down there. Protections for road, you need to put your stands, then build the roads to connect. Is it too far away to be putting GA over here, do you think? So all this all this space. It's hard to come up with a design because I don't know what we're trying to do here, you know? Come straight from one way to GA stand. Yeah, it's the um it's the pedestrian crossing, the zebra crossing that's kind of got me a little bit flummoxed. Where's the runway gonna go? Up here maybe? Okay, let's just stick it here. Go with that. See what happens. <laughs> Heron67, thank you for 22 months, Heron. Should be near the terminal. Well, it's not very really far away from the terminal. This is what I'm saying, though. It's uh, it's hard to know what you needed to do right now. Uh, right, small stand. We've done. Medium stand can be operated by commercial and can be built with concrete or asphalt foundation. Right. So in order to build the medium, you'd have to put down a foundation and then build it on top. Gotcha. Small aircraft may operate by both GA and smaller commercial flights. If you want to enable commercial flights on a stand, the stands are required to be placed adjacent to a terminal building with a secure zone and to be connected with a boarding desk. Stands that are only intended for operation by GA can be placed anywhere do not require connection. Okay. Well, I think we're okay with that for now. Don't forget you need to link the GA gates to your service road. Well, they are linked. Oh, the G wait a second. The GA gate. You need to link the GA gate to your service road. Once that's done, you need to build a taxiway to the GA gates and use a taxiway node to draw the taxiway planes to follow then build runway yeah i've not even looked at the taxiway or the runway i'm just not sure how to connect this in yet i'm hoping it's going to tell me ga doesn't have a gate you're fine okay um this still says in progress so i've not done something unless it's the old weird bug problem yes it is it's really weird if you stay in the manual section and just press tab, it doesn't update the in progress. You have to click away and click back and then it updates it. <laughs> Alright, Guzzy. Uh, continuing airside construction. To support aircraft operations, you need to construct a runway and an ATC. These can be built very easily. So this next... Uh, so this step will not go into the details of, of that here. Instead, we will focus on the taxiway construction. Mr. Jaggers, four years. You're the best man. Thanks for everything here and uh, all of the good games, Jaggers. Thank you for the delivery, dude. And once again, thank you for four years. Amazing support, Jaggers. Thank you. Is it a good game, Garden Data? It's kind of hard to tell right now. It seems to be quite deep. Deeper than Sim Airport was. Uh, first, you need to lay down a taxiway foundation of your choice and make sure it covers the full path from the runway to any aircraft stands. For placing a taxiway foundation, 
you can then specify the taxiway path, which is a path an aircraft will follow. Make sure that all aircraft stands have connection to the runway center line. Press T to toggle taxiway paths. Right, checklist, construct a runway. Tarmac. Small runway. Sports light and medium cleft. Okay, that'll do. I'll take that. Should we stick that up here somewhere? Give us a bit of room for expansion. Dynamic bone. Um, let's see. Construct an ATC tower. Happy anniversary, Nata. I if it matters where the tower goes. Do not put it too enough on the terminal. Well, that's not that far. A basic air traffic control tower enables regulation of traffic around your airport. Construction 15 grand. Uh, does it matter where this goes? The Beard 96 uh, with 31 months. Have been here for a while. I do hope you and the family are well. Yeah, we're doing fine. Thank you, The Beard. Welcome back. Uh, by Jokesy. Thank you for the resume. Benjamin Subs, if you need aircraft mechanics, my dad and I were more willing to help. <laughs> Thank you very much, Benjamin. Best not to put it in the flight. So not put it here, right? <laughs> End of the runway. Okay, taxiways are going to be here. Um, I don't know how much this matters right now. No, we'll just stick it here. I guess we can move it later. Chilly Willies, how you doing? Yeah, I mean, it seems to be fairly near the runway. Good visibility. I'm not sure if we need to connect it with any service roads or anything yet. Uh, lay down the taxiway foundation. Hmm. Foundation, let's see, service road, taxiway foundation, there you go. So, I'm guessing we need to link through here like this. Um, now, is it going to be like Sim Airport where you have to link both sides, otherwise, it doesn't count? My foundation. Wonder if that will be fine. Is wind simulated? Do they take off from different runways and stuff? Don't know. We'll see, we'll see if that works. I've no idea. Made them at least three wide, dude. What? It's only GA. Ouch, stop punching the microphone. <laughs> I'll get used to this thing. Uh, you can link it to one end of the runway. It doesn't matter. Okay. Three wide sounds awfully... I can't even see the rook. Have they constructed that? Because I can't see it. Uh, 
Aye, 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 aye. Don't know what's going on right now. Is it finished building or we're waiting for materials? Because I can't see the taxiway at all. Like it's constructed something. This game looks faff. Some people call that detail. Benjamin subs, I got hired by Dad's shop. Um, is the 325 MXS maintenance squadron working on A10s, C130s, and F16s? They're a lot bigger when you are in the fuselage cap. <laughs> That's awesome, man. Yeah, you built on a grass taxiway. You want the asphalt one? Uh, overall, it's a taxiway path. In oh God, really? Oh, look at that. Scumbag. Now I can't see where that goes up to. I can't even see where the old one is. Welcome to the nut house. So difficult to see where it's up to. Okay, we'll just do two then. I'll do. Something like that. Was that a double sub? Denty, uh, Denty Hades. Denty Hades, I'm not sure how you say that. And Weebs Gur. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Welcome to the house, guys. Thank you very much for your support. Thank you for giving them a, lo a lovely nutty welcome. Double sub. Squirrel, it must be three wide because you need to draw the center line later. Uh, it doesn't tell you that in the game, does it, though? That's really irritating. Are you sure it needs to be three wide just for a... Just for a GA? That sounds ridiculous. There you go. How's that then? Three wide for GA, five wide for company jets. It doesn't tell you this though, does it? Look, in this manual. Like, where does it say this? It doesn't. It doesn't, there's just no mention of this. Construct the tower, lay down taxiway foundation, drag out taxiway pads, make sure all taxiways are connected. Uh, hold down T for visual guidance, toggle holding down Kind of feel like these guys need to have some kind of um, little sidewalk thing. I feel like they can't even get to work, you know. How do they get over the taxiway? <laughs> Funny you should mention the double sub. Just got home from the subway. Should the runway not be asphalt too? Well, yes, but, you know, it doesn't let me build one. Like, if I click on s small runway, I don't seem to get an option for material. So I, I don't know how we can change that. You missed a bit of taxiway, bottom of the runway. Uh, did I? You can upgrade it later. Ah, okay. Ah, right. Both ways, GA, commercial. We'll say no to commercial for now. Upgrades. Extend the runway north, south, and upgrade to asphalt for 60 grand. There you go. Oh, yeah, yeah, Little yeah, Pappy yeah. lights, $500. 
class jump. How do you move this stupid thing out of the way so you can do stuff? I literally can't put Pappy Lights down here because when I click on it, click on upgrade, say build Pappy Light, I can't. <laughs> I want them over here. Pretty cheap for Pappy. You're not kidding. Probably cost $500 for the bulbs. Do the same with the plane parking and the road. What, the stand? Uh, GA. Upgrade. Upgrade to asphalt. There you go. GA. Upgrade to asphalt. Nice. Starting to look like something. Chop Siri Lewis, thank you for the 100 bits. I don't like the way it just insta upgraded the runway. Like, why did no builders run over and start constructing that? Why was the runway not closed for days while they completely resurfaced this? Okay. Once that's built, what else do we need to do? Uh, Zinam, we're in sandbox. Why? I haven't got a Scooby Doo. What we're doing? I've heard the economy is a little bit brutal. <clears throat> There's still a section of too wide taxiway. Oh, you mean this bit? Uh, Stephen C, hello Paul, another change of name. This one will be permanent, no longer Viking Ste. Alright, no worries Ste. Uh, there is game sound, but it's very, very, it's very quiet. Like, there's not a lot of, there's just general kind of noise. Not as far as I know, Garden Data. Chili Willies, thank you for the host. Uh, you need to draw the center line. Yeah, I'm just waiting for the taxiway to finish. Follow this, follow this taxiway node. Draw line. Right click on one near the ta runway to make it a runway ahead sign. Right, we'll try and figure that out in a sec. So you press T, click on a node. Nope. Wow, set pushback point. You what? <laughs> That's really cool. Wait, so how do you how do you do the thing? Taxiway pass. Taxiway node. Here we go. Must be placed on taxiway, foundation, or runway. right it certainly looks feasible top left of the stone doesn't look right is this going to get finished here or did I mess that up I can see the uh Whole short line, but I can't see anything else. Left me a post on Twitter. Okay. 
place must be renamed Lord Doyle International Airport. Doesn't matter, it only takes re uh, recreational flights as international because it's Lord Doyle. Nah, it can't be called that. Okay, taxiway node. What was Cussie saying about right clicking though? Does that look okay? Kind of looks logical. Left side of the taxiway is to the gra uh, a grass taxiway. Just look at the painted lines. Or well, that lot. I should get rid of it. Greetings, squirrel and cat. I don't have a cat, Cobalt. Of a dog. <laughs> right click on green dot to create a holding point. What? So you can put like. Click twice to rotate. Should have done it on that dot, do you think? Hmm. That'd be fine. It is detailed, isn't it? Compared to the same airport, it really is. Right, what was the... Um, what have we not done? Right, completed that. Alright, so we've completed the aircraft course. Let's go back. Um... Do, should we just open this thing? I, I don't know what's going to happen. How do we open this? Closed. Open runway. Okay, runway's open. I don't know if that's a good idea. <laughs> Turn on your GA flights to always accept and then open the runway. Uh, how do we do that? No stand is set to accept commercial flights. Did you enable commercial flights in the stand venue? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Parking is not open. Right, hang on. Uh, open stand. Okay. Can we... Can we... Yeah, but commercial does not require us to link up to... Um, the terminal and stuff, if you want commercial... Or did I misread that? See, the airport's closed. It shouldn't be closed. How do we open the airport? Surely we have to actually open the airport. Go to operations and click always accept GA flights. Oh, here we go. Airport open. Um, always accept GA. Open all security. I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> That's almost like turn off firewall. <laughs> yeah, B Sawyer, I'm playing it in sandbox mode and we're just trying to learn the game. $25. <gasps> oh my god. $25 we just got. We are minted. It's only costing us 200 an hour to run this airport. Where's that come from? Hasta La Vista International. It's going to Incheon International, Seoul, South Korea. It's going to South Korea? This plane is flying from North Korea to South Korea. It's a three hour and 10 minute flight. It's a Cessna 182. 
Wait, he's only got 9% fuel. He's going to have to reload. I hope we've got the fuel for this. Look, we, we do it all here. Main tank. We've got jet fuel. We've got av gas. We've got a lot. We're in North Korea, yeah. That's where we are. That's what everybody wanted. Four hours and 54 minute flights in a 182. Is he refueling? 30% fuel level. He's still not refueled yet. He's been sat here for ages. You need to have a fuel truck. What? Why is he leaving for a three hour flight with 9% fuel? Is this guy completely insane? What's he just planning a mid air refuel? $400 landing fee, I'll take that. You have to supply a fuel truck. Nobody told me about this. How do I get a fuel truck? Toggle rooms. No areas, items. How do we get a fuel truck? I have no clue. Not even got that far yet. You have to build a vehicle depot and buy a fuel truck. Oh my god, why did it not say so? <laughs> Infrastructure. Where is it? Car drop off. Bus shelter. At least the audio's good. Did you hear that plane? Fuel depot. Buildings. Here we go. Vehicle depot. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Did you hear that take off then? Right, we'll have it pointed in that way. I got to wait for that now. Thing is, on the refuel section, it never mentioned anything about that. I presume they're all for number number two daughter, I'm not sure. Need to check. Yeah, you have to check through them. Coffee. Uh, under procurement you can get trucks. I have to laugh these people just turning up going, can we get some fuel? I'm like, sorry, the CEO didn't buy a fuel truck because nobody told him to. I'll have to speed this up now. I need some more stands, that's what we need. Small stand. Do you reckon we can cope with a medium stand or not? Catering, cleaning, and de-icing. You can't get the staff these days. Oh, no, you see, if I'd have known that, look. See, this is exactly what I mean about the kind of thing you don't know until you understand the game better. I think medium stand should be maybe facing this way anyway. I think we should build some more stands because that just seems like a money machine. I mean, they're all paying $25 just to sit here. They pay 400 to touch down. Why, why would we not have more? Medium stands have to be connected to a terminal. Gotcha. Right, so the medium stand... If we put medium stands here and then expand the terminal a bit, something like that. You don't need that stuff. It just makes more money. That means you need it. Oh, that's hype on FIFA 18. Yeah, you, it's not really something I get hyped for. Right then. Close, upgrade capacity. Uh, let's slow it down a second while we go to economy, procurement. The Fjord fuel truck, here we go. Have gas. We need one of them. And we need... We don't need a Jet A1 yet. Happy anniversary. Technically. $1,500 plus $50 per hour. Are we going to have to pay that no matter what? Like all the way through the night when there's no flights, do we have to pay $50 an hour to this truck? I'm going to wait and see what happens with that one before we'll get the jet one. Because I don't want to get that one if we don't need it. You sound like the CEO of EA. <laughs> Lord Jerry, this baby is now kicking. One month left. And one thing, how's truck fest? Skip. I 
take it what the what the truck will do is Will he sort of load up and then go and refuel him and then him and him and then go back and refuel? Like he'll just keep doing it while he's got enough, basically. We start planning our medium stands. Um, let's see. So I'm, I'm going to... I don't know how much space I need to leave, so I'm just going to set it back. Because, you know, I don't know. Sim Airport has you put in these, like, baggage things down, so... He will load up and then go to fuel the aircraft. Yes, cool. So I'm thinking... Let's put one like that. One like that. And I guess we'll have to expand the... Terminal a bit. Foundation... Wait, didn't this need to be on a foundation or something like that? I can't remember. Welcome to the nut house. We do that, and then and that as well. How's this going to work with the internal wall thing? Because Sim Airport's a pain with that internal wall thing. It'll lay the foundation for you. Okay. Who was that he subbed? Elastic Jimbo! Thank you for subbing Elastic Jimbo. Welcome to the NetHouse, sir. Appreciate the support. Is this our fuel truck at last? Go on. Go and load up, bro. So I take it what's going to happen, he, he's going to load up from here, and then this will go down, and then a truck will come and replenish this, I assume. No, no takeaway tonight, Zinnam. I actually had a takeaway after last night's stream. <laughs> I finished last night's stream so hungry. I was like, right, I'm going to McDonald's, I'm done. I wanted a cheeky Nando's, but they're closed. You'll need to remove the internal wall yourself, but it won't make uh, as many internal walls as you get in some airport. Well, that's good. How do you actually remove the internal wall? Oh, he's full, 20,000 litres. It's like depleted 20k out of that tank. Uh, where are you going, dude? Where are you actually going? Why can't he just turn left out of there? That doesn't make much sense. He's gone back in the depot? Does he have to be told to refuel these people or what? <laughs> Where's he gone exactly? Tell Doyle that your dog said hi. Okay. Yeah, refuel the aircraft as they need it. So tell me this guy with 9% fuel and a 5 hour flight ahead of him doesn't need fuel. Tell, tell me why he doesn't need fuel. Requested services. I don't get this. Why is he not requesting any fuel? You need to enable refueling. How do I do that? How does... How do you enable refueling? You're not offering as a service. Okay. Operations enable fueling. Operations... Jet A1. Have gas refueling disabled. Scumbag game! Ramp agent service. That sounds good. What does that mean? Baggage handling disabled. Aircraft cleaning disabled. What on earth is this? Operate security station. I have no idea what this is. You'd have rage quit, Billy. $225 in per hour. 851 going out the door. 
That's not bad, actually. Come on, we're offering refueling. Why are you not asking for it? Aye, aye, aye. Emperor Cecily with, do you think this game looks like it's worth it? Um, if you like this kind of thing, it seems to be quite detailed, even at such an early stage. Huh? It's probably flat now, but yeah. Turn the other stands on. There's no point turning these stands on yet. We haven't even finished the, the, um, the rest of the airport. Right, why Christine, have a good one. Click on the parking position, not on the airport, so you can see which services are needed. Right. Repair, $700. Repair? What the heck? $1,000? What have they been doing to my stand? Upgrades. What is it? It doesn't mention fueling in the stand window. Yeah, I need to redo the walls and the security zones in a second. To get that commercial gate operation, you need to buy and assign a boarding desk. I know. Purchase it, go to it. I know, I need to rezone it as well, because he... Yep, there's a lot to do yet, because I've, I've got to work through the rest of the manual. Uh, let's see. General open. Why is it a connection? What the heck? I didn't put that there. Right, how do I get rid of that? How do I get rid of this thing? This holding point. Regular, there we go. Taxi way. Okay, right. Open stand. J A. See if we can sort out our debt crisis. There we go. The manual isn't much help right now. I think a lot of us in chat can help better than those stupid manuals, cause he. Right, Z turns on the zoning. Uh, so what we're going to need is, if this is secure area, we're going to we're going to need a wall and then an exit secure area zone because all that's going to be secure. And then I guess baggage collection will be. Actually, baggage collection could go here, couldn't it? Thinking about it. Structures foundation. If this was baggage. Yeah, we could sort of take everybody here and then filter them through a filter them through like a one way there must be an object for this. Like a one way door for security. Click on a parking position if an aircraft is on it, then you can see on the pop up on the left side if a refuel is needed, the truck isn't coming because it's not needed. Here's, here's my question though, Nitro. Why is it that a Cessna 182, which is planning a five hour flight and has 9% fuel left, why is that Cessna not requiring fuel? Did not wear the stand to asphalt. Because North Korea physics. <laughs> what? That's how the game works. Well, the game is wrong! Uh, the yellow icon on the flight schedule is the ground time, not the flight time. Okay. So this plane landed at 17.47. Okay, so that's nearly 6pm. It's on the ground for 5 hours and 38 minutes. 
but then somehow it's taken off at 6.15. But it appears to be on the ground for 12 hours. Wait, what? You need to hire a fuel truck driver? Are you for real? How do I even access the fuel truck now? Because it's disappeared into here and I can't see it anymore. Like, he's in here, but I can't get at him. Ooh. Ooh, you can colour stuff. Look at this. You can colour the depot. Come on, put your hand up and tell me if you knew that. Hey, hey, but that wasn't in the manual. It can't leave until 6.15 because that's the government restricted flight time. Yeah, that's fair enough. Under staff. Are you sure you need a drive for the truck? We've got the CFO, the CIO, the oh, CEO, yeah, yeah, yeah. the strategy director and a HR director. Activity, wander, stand still. <laughs> oh my God, where is she? What are you doing apart from standing around at the bus drop off point? Benjamin Stubbs, Man manual is a scumbag. It is. Gastra, 12 months, whoop, whoop, one whole year in the house. Thank you for the awesome content. Gastra, thank you, dude. You need a propaganda director. Okay, so I need to find... This is going to be a baggage zone, but I need to find the uh, the object that lets me go through. Fuel tank, let's see, weather station, one of them. Medium door, small door, and a large door? No. It's going to be where all the desks and stuff are, aren't they? Check-in desk, info desk, small security checkpoint, security exit, there we go. It's going to be one of these things. So if we make this a security exit, must be placed inside a secure zone. Right. How do we demolish a wall? Yeah, I thought so, Kizzy. How do we get rid of... Um, these walls here, does anybody know? I guess we've got to do structure, wall, and then control. I really hope this is right. Something like that. Seems feasible. Then we can just rezone that security and then cut it up later. Use the bulldozer. Uh, that sounds like it might destroy the foundation, though, cuz he. Uh, Golic YouTube. <coughs> Thank you for subbing, Golic. Welcome to the house. Thank you for giving him a nutty welcome, guys. Right, areas. Secure. Just gonna make. All of that secure for now. So we'll put that in the middle, maybe. Thinking about it. Bathroom, uh, baggage claim. That will be baggage claim. This will be security exit. We don't want it to be too near that, do we? Why can't you make it wider? 
Is uh, the Nuts House is one big family garden data. Um, community is probably the word, not family, community. See, where do people. People are going to get off first. The desk is going. I need to be careful here because. I think maybe I should move this a bit further south. I don't like that. It's too close because I can just imagine people flooding out of here and then just getting clogged up there. I feel like I want the security exit a bit further away. So we'll just move this down a little bit. We'll get rid of that wall there. Uh, we'll expand that wall in a little bit. Oh, what we'll do is we'll put that wall across there. Something like that. Put several of them. I don't... Um... I guess that's possible. We can try it. Right, so if that's baggage claim, then is it? Wish this thing had stopped jumping around like that. That's a scumbag. We'll just put some wall in between. There you go. Into the baggage area. And then we could just put some doors down here. Large door. There you go. Uh, thank you, Golic. Most of us are robots. <laughs> now, nah, people chilling out. Especially if it's a new game, they're just kind of... People tend to just watch. Uh, can you not have multiple floors in this game? Uh, you can, Hayden, because I put... When I zoned it out, I had secure. And then I put... Um, baggage in here. And secure and baggage were overlapping at one point. So I think you can. Why has that disappeared? Oh, that's fine. It's weird. When I put the zone thing on, it doesn't actually show this area. Anyway, I quite like that. I think that's going to work. So people just flood out that way and then they can leave fairly quickly, I think. Right then. So, in lieu of the fact that we might need more than one, like, baggage, uh, no, what they call this, security checkpoint. I think we might need a couple along here. Which would mean destroying that wall, wouldn't it? We have an ATC already, likes technology, we've done that. Demolish this wall back here. And then... Small security checkpoints. Security checkpoints. Uh, 
Uh, Valio belts. <laughs> Belt technology stuff is coming later. We've not even looked at that yet. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Like that. Like that. If we need more, we can always build this way and do it. So we'll, we'll just um, call it complete there. Just finish the wall off. Cool, that'll do for now. Um, Referic, I found a bug in this game. You did? <laughs> Many people in the general public and news media refer to the apron at airports as the tarmac, despite the fact that most of the areas are often paved with concrete, not tarmac. Hmm. Yeah, there's some truth in that. 